Hey everyone, Kyle once again, and welcome back to uh, the next episode review of Chain Soldier Episode 8. Since which I first of all, sorry for getting to a bit later on this one, because, well, first of all, the episode got delayed a week, so, but after that, I got busy. I usually do it on Saturday, so, but, but I got busy, so I couldn't do it, so, sorry to do it this late, though, but, but after all, anyway, but after the, um, but after uh, uh, de being delayed a week, though, but it was worth the wait because I enjoyed the episode regardless. So, yes, there were, in this episode there was no there was no action in it, so that was perfectly fine with it because you don't have to have every episode doesn't have to have action in it it's just to make the episode good, you know. Although we like I like seeing uh of Jun of Jun Jun Woo being badass though while well, leveling leveling up though, but still. But anyway, um, in this episode where. Trying to make this brief though, because I feel like it won't be too long on this one. But um, we still we still have get, we get more character development. You know, we get our with our guy um, Jin Ho. Um, you know, the guy, the kid from from the previous dungeon, the fancy armor, trying to uh, tell, uh, trying to make you know tell Jin Woo to you know build our own uh, guild. You know, with our own make our own team basically, right? And after when Jin Woo, Jin Woo said no though, but. Here he is. He's doing. He's trying to try to ask again, though. But I think, um, but he's trying. He's just trying to ask again. And then while it's going on, we have um, with with Jim Will with like his with this with this video game menu, right? You get some interesting thing. First of all, I made it interesting because of um, because remember how in the beginning where after being basically brought back, right? Where you have the do you do these requests or you get penalized, right? Basically. Don't do your exercise, you get penalized, right? Well, he was wondering because it was makes it interesting though because if if he doesn't do his exercise, yeah, he gets penalized, he gets sent to this place where he has to uh, do the request for about being chased by a monster, right? Well, he's wondering if he doesn't if he purposely doesn't deliver doesn't do it and he goes to there, right, and faces that monster he, he ran from before, right? But instead of running, what if he gets he gets a face it and defeats it? Will he get extra points for it, right? So that was kind of inter it makes it an interesting question. So if you get delivered, just delivery, don't do that. Get penalized on purpose, so you can go into and face that monster and defeat it. Will he get extra points though? Right? It makes kind of makes kind of interesting thing though. But why not risk? You know, I mean, first of all, people were criticizing. Oh you know, well, how dumb where he was in this, where he barely made a made out of C rank dungeon, but he jumped right into an S rank, you know, dungeon, right? Although he was smart enough to not go, not to go on that burning castle, though he was smart enough, though, right? Because he was trying to, because he after learning about this elixir of life, you know, he can try to build it to to help cure his mom, right? Because now, because why wouldn't he? Because what you try to do whatever you take to save the life of a loved one, right? And so that's what he's trying. That's what he's trying to do, and. He gets his used bingo car, which that's another thing. Well, in this episode, he gets his used bingo car, not a brand new one, but. <laughs> feel like they're trying to try to throw up a curveball at this our our main guy all the time, right? So he gets his used bingo card, <laughs> and we get more bond with his sister and her, like I said, just help trying to help his mom, and then we then we also we with the we get the um the returning people um from that was that was in the first the the, the dungeon they went to and they almost got killed, right? Um. We have one one of the guys who ran who 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 managed to escape, and he has a family, right? And say, hey, I'll come back, right? And the one guy who lost the one guy who and the one the posted the, the leader of that previous dungeon who lost his arm, right? He's just trying to do. He still wants to continue on to for the uh, benefit of society. Now I'm seeing, now I'm seeing these guys return, right? And if they still want to go on this another mission. I'm thinking to myself, these guys are not gonna, are, are probably gonna die, right? Because you don't bring these characters back because if they get two on this dun uh, the next dungeon, oh, we see a guy who has a family and the guy who survived, who barely survived, but he has one arm, right? He says he won't continue to benefit the society. I'm thinking, I'm like, okay, these guys are probably gonna die, right? They're showing, like, basically having a neon sign above them saying, hey, probably gonna die next, probably. <laughs> So we have, we we see the, these guys come back though, but they're probably just gonna end up dying again. Probably that's what I'm assuming. So, um, and then we get look our our our, our girl that um that our friends with our main guy right the the B rank healer right I forgot her 
I forgot her name too, though, but uh, she was the B-Ray killer. That's basically who liked um, our main guy, right? Who basically was severely traumatized for what happened in that dungeon, right? PSD and all that stuff, right? And here she's still, she is still being traumatized. And first of all, part of me just doesn't doesn't blame her because I mean, after what they've been through in that one dungeon, after nearly getting crushed to death by those big statues and stuff, right? Who wouldn't blame? I wouldn't blame her for being, you know, doesn't you know, being that much, <laughs> being PTSD, right? And and here she and she still is being, she's still suffering from trauma, and and we see her on our bed, like she, her her mom is calling her, you know, instead of being supportive though, right? I'll say hey, you're a B rank though, right? You should probably, you know, yeah, okay, so I still support you, you know, you should probably, you know. Just take your time and all stuff. If you want to go, you want to go though. But, and, but she gets you know, She says, you know, you're a B rank though. But aren't you? Aren't you in in the way? I'm like, damn. You know, I'm like, what? Kind of, I mean, that was like disrespect, man. Yeah, yeah, you're a B rank though. But you just only be in the way, right? And I wouldn't blame her for just hanging up on the phone like that. You know, I wouldn't blame her. I mean, just like you know, yeah, you're in the way. I mean, hello. Once you go, once you be in her situation, and you think that you uh, think you would only be in the way, you know. I mean, the mom just like okay, said so being supportive. No, you just know you just end up being in the way. Yeah, really, uh, <laughs> really good parenting skills are showing support there, right? I mean, so I feel bad for our for the main girl, right? I mean, it's just yeah, you're traumatized. She's just she's still traumatized. Still, she's trying to like we saw her in that one one out on the street though, but. uh... She still can't fully. She's still shaken up, you know. And think that she's gonna be going on this next ride with our main guy Junwu, right? And he's asking her, you know, if you're ready, are you still ready? She she'll go with. She still wants to. She'll still go with you, you know. She's preparing to go with them, but you know, is she gonna be still shaken up though? Of course she will be. And I, and also in the mix though, people are going in the next raid. They're going to. They're throwing all these 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 uh, criminals, you know. Also makes another interesting thing is that with these this this criminal system, right? Getting these convicts out, you know, hey, if you do these raids, you'll get some uh, years off your sentence, right? But of course, we know these 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 criminals are going to probably do some shady shady uh you know stuff, right? I mean, probably got to probably screw these guys over or try to do something stupid, try to get probably get one of these guys killed or you know every man for himself, right? I mean, these are these are convicts, right? I'm sure they're not gonna try not to pull something during during the raid, right? So, yeah, but it was interesting to bring up with with these criminals too. But the, our main girl, you know, just like just still traumatized, still shaken up though. But she's still gonna go on. She's gonna go on this raid with our with our with Jin Woo, right? So, yeah, that's pretty much that pretty much that pretty much sums up this episode for the most part. So, yeah, I apologize for being this late because like I said, I was busy and push, you know. But after being a week delayed, it was still um, worth the wait. But um, but <laughs> but I just, I just felt I just felt bad for the maker. I just for, for the maker. I, I'll remember her name again though. But still dealing with still PTSD, still PTSD basically, and just. But of course, there's gonna be a come a time where she's got to overcome that fear and just help though. But of course, that that happens a lot and other stuff. So. But yeah, but that's that's episode uh, eight of Ch of um, I was gonna say Chain Soldier, but uh, solo leveling. It was worth the wait though. Like I said, you don't have to have an, every episode doesn't have a half action in it just to make an episode good though, right? You still get this, you get char more character development, more um, some interesting exposition and stuff like that though, right? But um, but the next episode will have to hopefully it'll be more interesting. So. Especially now we're dealing with con like convicts now in your group, right? And your girl, your main girl, is still very hesitant on one on this next raid. So, but anyway, but anyway, thanks for watching. Stay tuned for the next episode, and we'll see you next time. Later.